Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Defense Committee of the Italian Chamber of Deputies has given its approval for the acquisition of German Leopard 2 tanks. Nino Minardo, President of the Defense Committee, emphasized the significance of this decision, stating that it paves the way for a comprehensive program aimed at revitalizing the Army's armored fleet. He stressed the urgency of this renewal due to the outdated nature of current systems and the evolving needs of NATO in light of recent global developments. According to information from Analyza de FESA, the chosen variant of the Leopard 2 tank is likely to be the Leopard 2A8. The acquisition program for the Leopard 2A8 is set to span 14 years, with two distinct phases. An initial phase, 2024 to 2026, focused on preparatory activities and a subsequent phase, 2027 to 2037, dedicated to the procurement of 132 Leopard 2A8 tanks. These tanks will form the core of two tank regiments and up to 140 related armored platforms, supplying heavy, medium, and light brigades, engineering regiments, logistic regiments, and training institutes within the Army. The Leopard 2A8 represents a significant advancement in the Leopard tank series, boasting improvements in armor protection, firepower, and technology integration. Featuring upgraded composite armor, including modular components for adaptable defense against emerging threats, the Leopard 2A8 is equipped with a sophisticated 120mm smoothbore gun capable of firing various types of ammunition. Enhanced targeting and fire control systems ensure heightened accuracy and lethality on the battlefield. Moreover, the Leopard 2A8 incorporates cutting-edge digital systems for battlefield management, communication, and situational awareness, setting new standards in armored vehicle performance and capability. These advancements position the Leopard 2A8 as a formidable asset on the modern battlefield, offering superior protection, firepower, and technological sophistication. The acquisition is estimated to cost 8.246 billion euros, with Minardo highlighting the expediency of procuring existing German-made vehicles to meet Italy's requirements. However, he also underscored the potential positive impact on Italian SMEs, envisioning the creation of a technology-oriented supply chain that could stimulate employment and skill development. Production of all 272 armored vehicles, including recovery tanks, bridge-laying tanks, and engineering vehicles, will take place in Italy at Leonardo facilities in La Spezia, involving the integration of national electronic systems and the collaboration of various Italian and German companies. The addition of Leopard 2A8 tanks to the Italian Army, alongside the existing 9125 RE8A C2 tanks, signifies Italy's commitment to modernizing its armored forces in response to evolving security demands. This investment not only enhances military capabilities but also contributes to the growth of the national economy through the involvement of local industries. That's all for now. See you later.